I believe Patterson Farms is the best cucumbers in the world. <laughs> you won't get better, that's for sure. Subway stores can't get any fresher produce on what they can source off these local farms. The produce is A1, it just can't get any better. I think it's looking good. The new growth's coming on well. Whenever I'm walking down the rows um, of my greenhouse, the main thing that I'm looking out for is my leaves. If your leaf's good, your cucumber's going to be good. Whenever the uh, crop is harvested, I myself and my wife does the packaging, so there's nothing goes out through the door without my eye or my wife's eye, for sure it is A1 standard. We call it Burnack and sometimes we have a, there's a truck in the yard maybe five days out of the week and straight into the shops, it's probably in the shops the next day. Burnack Produce is an outstanding example of a supplier partner who champions the brand at the grassroots level. They invested their own time and resources to develop and implement a highly successful produce program. At Burnack, we're super excited to be able to promote and, and support Subway's goals of being fresher. And this Ontario project it was really a, a shining example of how we were able to achieve that and how we were able to make Subway fresher every day. The Foodland Ontario logo was very prominent in all of the POS material in the stores. The fact is the local program is a wonderful opportunity for consumers in Canada to really capitalize on our desire to eat fresh. The Ontario Greenbelt Fund is a nonprofit organization that is working to increase the amount of local produce that the Ontario farmers and the Canadian farmers are providing by having it come from the Greenbelt area, it is reducing truck miles, lowering pollution, reducing food miles, and getting it to the stores fresher and quicker. We were able to basically double the amount of locally grown produce that's put into Subway stores uh, in the course of the year. It's time for Mother Nature to step up this year. Yes, <laughs> yes. Here at Smith Gardens, we provide red onions for Subway. The uniqueness of this onion in this growing area where we are is that we're very consistent in what we grow here, so we don't get major swings. As far as freshness goes, the product isn't sitting on a truck for weeks at a time. It's being harvested and it's being shipped out to the restaurants and it's being used. It's being consumed within probably four or five days of being harvested. It makes me feel very proud to be able to support a company like Subway. When you're in the restaurant, you can see the people enjoying their sandwich and you know that you're a part of that. Uh, you know, not everybody puts the red onions on their sandwich, but they should. <laughs> Having local growers like Patterson Farms and Smith Gardens who can meet and exceed Subway's gold standards for quality and more importantly, food safety, it's a win for all our local farmers. I feel like our farmers are very, very happy to be supporting Subway. They want the world to know how hard they work to bring the quality produce and the safe produce to Subway. Exploding in your mouth, that other. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> my passion is that uh, to keep going forward. More of my family is getting more interested in, in working on the farm, which is very encouraging. It's not only my work, but it's my entire family. So I'm very proud of what we have done here. Well, oh, darling, that's so sweet. <laughs>